Does making salam with the Imam invalidate the prayer? How? I mean, before the Imam? The Imam already said the salam. Okay, if you say the salam, it cannot be. <laughs> Either you go before him. Or <laughs> if you say the salam before the imam, yes, you destroy your prayer. If you're, uh, what do you call, saying it with the imam, which I cannot imagine that, exactly the same time you say with the imam, it's either you go first or he goes first. It's so useless to see this kind of practices among the Muslims, Allah. Yani, no matter how much you try, you cannot finish your prayer before the Imam. And I make ruku with him. I, I told you last time I was praying next to a person, uh, he got stuck. Seriously, this one I saw with my own eyes, he got stuck. The Imam is very slow in sujood. And the guy was going with the Imam to sujood. The Imam is not yet going. So the, imam, the, the, the guy was in the ruku. You know, he was standing. And now the Imam is going to bow for sujood. So the, what do you call the, the Ferrari left before the Imam. So the Imam did not reach and the guy already reached the level of the Ruku, so he got stuck like this, waiting for the Imam to go. Yeah, he, so, <laughs> they get it. So Umar radiallahu anhu met somebody who was doing that. He said, Ya hada, la wahdaka sallayt, wa la bi imamika aktadayt. Do you get it? Umar saw somebody who was racing with the Imam, he said, Brother, you neither follow the Imam, and at the same time also you do not pray alone. So which category are you? We don't know. You are not praying alone, and you are not praying with the Imam, and this prayer, that, what does that mean? This prayer has not position in Islam, right? You lost the whole thing. So it's all about patience, patience, patience. A person is not allowed to go before the Imam. Uh, the companions of the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, Jabir said, we see, we, when we see the forehead of the Prophet some are touching the ground, that moment we bow. They were standing until they see him to the ground. Then they go. As I said, it is so illogical for me to race with the Imam since I cannot finish my prayer before him. So why do I need to keep on going? Okay, at the end of the day, I go, I went before him. I'm going to wait for him, right? To finish the shawl and come and meet me there. So what is the point? If I'm in hurry, just cut your prayer and go and do your business right. Allah guide us to the truth. Allah.